You are so sweet. Mama loves you. Oh, Jesus. Hello, everybody. What's up? Welcome to my channel. Excuse me. <laughs> she is so funny. So today's video is going to... I can't even film right now. My goodness. How am I supposed to film with a cute kitty? So today's video is going to be a part two of us trying out Wish Home Decor. Last time we had a lot of gadgets and less decor, but this time we have a mixture of both. We have really cute items, really cute, which I hope they turn out cute, um, items for home decor. And then we also have a couple of gadgets we're gonna be trying out today and see how they work. I will link part one down below in the description box if you wanna see the other half of this video. I mean, I guess it's kind of the other half. It's just like the first version of this video. I'm having a lot of fun with Wish Home Decor. I'm gonna have Ty up in here helping me and we're gonna go ahead and jump right in and get started. By the way, thank you guys for watching my home content. Hope you're enjoying it. I love doing beauty and I still do a lot of makeup on my channel, but it's so much fun to get to mix it up and like try different things. So, so with that being said, be sure and subscribe to my channel. And now let's go ahead and jump right in. Hey Ty, you want to show them the first item? What is this? Well, the first item is an item one and two. So it looks like this, it is supposed to trim like, I don't know, like pieces of carpet that have been lifted where my cats have like... Clawed. Okay, that piece is already loose, but like these pieces are still attached. All there's these are. Yeah, there's a bunch. So we were going to try to like cut... And it also came with one of these, another cutter. So we have two of them. We're going to try out both today. So it's item one and two, I guess. Um, I'm kind of nervous. It's not even this... sharp. Like I'm. Well, this is a nice rug. Like I'm scared I'm going to tear it up. Have you told them how much this rug costs? And we're using a Wish item, which was probably like a dollar on it. It seems legit. Yeah, it seems <laughs> real legit. All right, so this one's definitely connected. You want to get in here? All right. Yeah. Yeah, Give it connected. a go. Let's this one's connected let's too. Let's destroy this rug. I'm assuming I just like pulled. That's so. what it was like showing. It was like little rakes. You ready? Yeah. Do it. Now, nah, boy, get in there. I just like, I don't want to do it on air. Let me try. Where it doesn't need to be done. Ah. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. So I got a patch over here. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, it's working pretty good. Look at that, guys. Yeah. And look how much smoother the area is. Oh my God, it's like, it's just lightly trimming the loose hair. It like, honestly seems like it's lightly shaving it. Yeah. I think you're gonna so have to that like needs longer to be cut, to cut. And then, but like the shorter pieces, and then look. All of it just comes up. Wowzers. Okay, so see, we got a few right here. Let's give it a second go. Oh yeah, that smooths it out some, don't you think, Ty? What yeah. do you think? It just like is not cutting the long ones is the problem. Well, maybe that's a good thing, so it doesn't really damage the rug. It's just more so trying to I'll get try this one. trying to get so like here's some long. So here. that one's more so for clothes. Do you have some clothes with lint on it? Oh look, Yay. it got the long piece. Oh shoot. And it's I'm barely putting any pressure. You really don't need much pressure and it just kind of softly removes. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. Okay. Well What are you rating it? We kinda had our verdict. You guys know we have to rate it. What are you rating it? For what it cost and like what it said it did. I just don't know if I have any clothes with a bunch of lint on it. Do you? I probably could find some stuff. Oh well, yeah, let's definitely find something. For okay, this one. but what do you rate it though? I rate it like an eight out of ten. I'll give it like a six or seven. I go with one of my jackets that I had to stop wearing because of how much lint it attracts. Look at all that. I think this is, but this will remove the lint amazingly. But my concern is this cuts off loose fibers that came out of your like your sweater. Let's just try. Okay, I say we try to. Take I don't some. care either way. I think this is more of like a sticky tape situation, but I'm so down because I think it'll work. You ready? Yeah. Let's see what we got. I'm ready. Got a good view. I got it. You're nice and in there. I told you that is not what this is for. <laughs> Boy. Let me see the other one. Here, here, here. Flop. Okay. Yeah, the other one definitely. Oh, was. my oh, God. Oh, wow. Whoa. Whoa. 
Okay, this thing is so bomb. All right, I just bumped it up to an eight. Okay, give it Maybe the nine. Even a nine. Give it the nine that I'm it deserves. It Dang. So even if your jacket's covered in lint, it will literally do all tiny right. short strokes. Look at that. And you'll get all of it. Look at how much is coming off. Dang. Look at that. Like I could do. Like I said, I wanted to do this to the rug all day long. This is amazing. <laughs> We're gonna have the thinnest rug ever. <laughs> gonna be like this then. He's still going. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Ty, you have to stop. It, it's, it looks good. We'll, we'll Look be, that. we'll be back in an hour. <laughs> okay, the next item I got is a moon lamp. This is supposed to be really cool. Um, it's supposed to look like the moon when you light it up, like a little moon in your room. And it's supposed to be a nightlight. So I have never opened this box. We're going to open it together. And then we're going to turn off all the lights. Plug it up and see if it works. Actually, we're going to plug it up. Then turn off all the lights and see if it works. Shout out to Manny MUA. You oh, can shoot. find these Manny's on LunarBeauty.com. You can't, but he should sell these. <laughs> he should. Oh, what does that look like? Okay, that does not look like a moon. Okay. It'll probably look more like the moon when it lights up. Oh, yeah, it comes with the stands. Oh, it's just like a little LED light thing. Okay. Ties are set or upper. Oops. Hold that. Go look at the box and see like how I put I'm assuming we make a... It's already defective. Like I can't <gasps> plug it in. What? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Yeah, this one's a flop, Laura. Babe, you had to fix it. Hanging. Like whoever put this together did a terrible job. And it doesn't come apart either. He's got needle nose pliers and we're trying to open the hole up so that that way we can get the little light out so we can plug it up. The light is supposed to be coming through the hole and you're supposed to be able to just go boop, came and plug it up. So it's yeah. like floating around in there. Yeah. But I brought the big guns. Okay. Oh, hoo -hoo. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, dude. Safety first. Woo! I brought you a pair too, dude. I love you. I don't wear some. <laughs> I want to be included. <laughs> Alright, Laura, you're going to hold them. Kidding. No. Please, oh, God, no. Yeah! Wait. I'm getting this everywhere. <laughs> like burnt nail polish. See how the light is floating in there, guys? I think we need out though. Okay, guys, we got the light out. So what I'm going to do now is kind of jam it so it doesn't fall back in like that. And then we're going to plug it up and it sits upside down like this. So you won't see it? Yeah. They're you're like, Wish is like, oh yeah, this is what you're supposed yeah, to yeah, do. Yeah, yeah, supposed to drill a hole in it first. <laughs> and rig it. All right, drum roll. Here she goes. You will need an extension cord. It's oh, literally, wait, let's turn wow. on the lights off. <gasps> wow. It's blue. They kind of showed online looking white. Guys, the light for it, it's broken. It doesn't even work. It's, this thing is um like just a part of the chipboard that's lighting up blue. Do you get what I'm saying? Like the lights. Oh! There it is. I pushed the button. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's so cool. It's okay, changing well, colors. Wait, 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 I have to push. Right. Wait. Oh my gosh, it does kind of look like a little moon. This yeah. is white. I don't know why it looks pink in the sliding. You can control the different what? levels. You want a red moon? Ooh. A green moon? That's kind of cool, I guess. I mean, I rate this a one out of... I mean, it, it was so faulty and rickety. But, I mean, I might give it a 2 out of 10. What do you rate it? Uh, yeah. I mean, if it wasn't crap and falling apart, I would give it like a 2 or a 3. I'd give it a 1. All Let's right. See. Ooh, oh, the look. white one's it by pulses. far the prettiest. Yeah, I wish it wasn't falling apart, but 2 out of 10 it is. Okay, guys, for the fourth item that we're trying out is the Cactus Neon Light. I actually ordered three of these, and they haven't come in yet. Um, so this was my favorite one by far that I ordered, and it came in first. So I thought we'd go ahead and try it out. I'll let you guys know on update on IG Story how the other ones work, but I've never plugged this up. 
you will need a cube and we're gonna see how cool it is. We're gonna go back into the game room where it's darker. I'm ready. Rolling? I'm rolling. Ah, uh, so beautiful. There's a switch on it. You gotta click her on Look the cord. Yep. Oh. Ready? Boom. Oh, it works! Yeah, it it freaking works and it looks so cool. That is so cool. I love it. It's got a little hole so you can hang it on the wall. I this one's like 10 out of 10. This, this one's, one's really cool. This one's bomb. I like that it has a switch on the cord. I mean, not our aesthetic. We can give this to Aaron. Yeah. It's a 10 out of 10 for Aaron. 10 out of 10 for Aaron. This one was easy. This one wasn't a nightmare. We didn't have to drill it. Duh. I really like it. And then the back of it's just. Yeah. Y'all, Laura's been holding on to this thing for about a month now. I was waiting on the other ones to I come know. in, but I'm they just, won't I'm talking about like the dedication in. Laura puts into these uh, wish videos. Yeah, she I has do. to order stuff and stuff comes in sporadically through like a month or two. Yeah. I've been waiting forever to do this. Yeah. Yeah. What you got? The next item I have from Wish is a pot holder. Um, I'm really nervous to put one of my plants in it because if it breaks and falls, I'm gonna be devastated. But I think this would be really pretty. Um, I guess I didn't realize you only get one. I think it'd be pretty if you had two or three, so I might order more if it works out. But let's go try it out with a plant inside the plant holder. Should we try her? It might be too big for it. Let's try it. All right, I'm putting it in. I don't actually know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm like gonna get mad at it if it falls, but I don't know what I'm doing. Babe, I might need help. Yeah, I think you need help. You know, you're putting a pair of pants on it. <laughs> oh my God, please help me. That is not how you do it, give it to me. Okay. Oh my gosh, he got it guys. Oh, why is it so cute in there? Wait, let's fix her hair. <gasps> Oh my gosh, when is the doorbell not ringing? Let me go tell Aaron to get it. Okay. This looks really good, I like it. I think it's so pretty in there, actually. I'm gonna hang that somewhere. I think I might hang it like in a corner of some sort. There's no hooks in You could put one there. right there, huh? You want me to... Do you think it'd be cute? Yeah. Up there? Or is oh, it, yeah, it's probably too that. short. It probably needs to hang from a lower ceiling. Right. If it hung from like, maybe one of these. I'm going for that vibe. Right. <laughs> I, feel like it, I don't know. Anyways, it works. It's really cute. I like it. I love it. I, I give this a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Feels good quality too. Yeah, I like the coloring of it. All right, we got a winner. Woo! This <laughs> item is a throw blanket, and this is kind of random, but they advertise it as a comforter, and it was so affordable. I was like, there's no way. It really looks that cute. It's super soft. But then it came in and it's really kind of cute. So I thought I'd try it out for all of us who are curious about that. Because blankets can be kind of pricey. Feel it. Oh my gosh. 10 out of 10 so for softness. Soft, so soft. Let's see how big it is. Whoa. Are you kidding? How much was it? I can't remember. I'll have to put it on the Ooh, screen. Big. Oh my God. It's huge. Whoa. No that's wonder it. it was advertised like a comforter. That's like six <gasps> feet. The other side of it's like a velvety material, guys. It's yeah. so soft. What the heck? That is so nice. Are you kidding? <laughs> See myself draped in this. Um, wow. So, what do we rate this? 10 out of 10. Boy, I would stop doing 10. that and let me wash this oh, thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I, I honestly can't believe it. I just knew it would be the thinnest falling apart blanket ever. Um, but it's actually really nice. So I'm pretty excited about this. And I think they might have had it in different colors. Um, if they did, I'll put that on the screen. But this is pretty nice. I'll honestly probably throw it in one of my baskets, like blanket baskets. And we'll use it as a big cozy blanket because All you right, could probably use this wait okay from z gallery oh girl you just feel the difference can't. it it feels it's a little thinner but it feels just as soft it's way thinner like this blanket is so freaking heavy yeah. right here because it's thicker yeah this one this yeah. one's more luxe for sure but this still good quality and this one's way bigger than that one so oh yeah yeah way bigger see that's how big that one is so yeah, I'm pretty freaking impressed. Yeah. 
of these and it's been a month. I have one of them and we're gonna try this one out. It's a plant holder? It's a plant holder. So this I thought was like a porcelain ceramic material, but it's actually just plastic. Um, so it's a little cheapy, but mm, that's not, does it sit in there right? Yeah, it does. kind of. Okay. There you go. That's really cute. I like the geo shape. So there's a visual of what it would look like. I'll put the size of this one. I believe this was the small. They have like medium and large. They were really, really affordable. Boy. There you go. <laughs> okay, we have a little fake plant. Oh, oh can you shove it? <laughs> it's a little too big. We're trying to. You have to trim it a little bit. But... Yeah. There you go. I do have another fake plant that's a little bit smaller somewhere in the and south. <gasps> so cute! Oh my god! Put it on the wall. Oh my god! It needs a smaller plant. Yeah, it does. But it's pretty cute. What would you rate her? I mean, it looks decent enough, so I would give it like a seven. Yeah, it's me kinda, too. Like it's literally so light and cheap, though. Yeah. But you don't. Really, I mean, aesthetically, it just looks good. Yeah, so I think a 7-2. Fair game. So this is pompous grass. This is like Lux pompous grass that I did not get off Wish. I got this off Etsy and I'm obsessed with it. It's very trendy right now and it's very pricey for nice pompous grass unless you live in an area where you can just go get it. It's pricey, um, but it's beautiful and very trendy. So I searched pompous grass. So I searched pompous grass on Wish. And I got some. <laughs> um, okay, here's the thing. I do like all sizes of pompous grass. It's shedding all pompous. Is it real? I don't know. I don't I don't think it is. I don't think it is either. Here's the thing. I paid almost nothing for this, so I can't be mad. Also, you step pompous out in the sun and it really opens up. And what was really cute when it came in, it was just like little strings. And I set it out in the sun and look how much they open. Like, it was so hilarious. So maybe it is real because they did open up. Let's pull out one piece of pompous to compare one piece to that. I would never do that. <laughs> okay, so what I did is actually I got this vase from West Elm. I had to read because I was like, I forgot where I got this. And oops. And I put it in here. Why is it kind of cute? <laughs> Would it look better with the real pompous? Probably. This is real, I think. Okay. But honestly, for the price, if you wanted to play around with the natural pompous vibe in your home, like it's not that bad because I paid barely nothing for it. You rate it. Okay, what do I rate it? I mean, like you can't really compare whenever the price is included. I give this like a three out of 10. Maybe a four. Let's give it a four. For the a price. four for the price. Okay. So yeah, I ordered pompous grass off Wish, and um, here you have it. <laughs> okay, guys. So the last item is not a home item, but I thought you guys might enjoy me trying this out anyway. So I saved it for last. This is a two-in-one hair straightener. It's supposed to curl your hair and straighten it because it's wavy. I only have one hand. <laughs> Here's an example of how fabulous my hair is supposed to look after using it. This is what it looks like. I feel like I tried one of these like five or six years ago and it was a failure, but I'm willing to try it again today to see if I improved my skills of this contraption. So let's go try it out. Alrighty, are we ready to see what I can do? I think you like, oh God. I think I need to heat it up a little more. I have it heating up. I'm just not that skilled, you know? Ooh. Okay, it feels really hot. So I think I like go like this and then I flip it around. Oh, I'm doing a, okay. Okay, let's try again. I think I'm gonna do a little bit smaller hair. So like, this and like that. Huh. One more time. So maybe we really just go. Ow. Okay. 
Okay, I am with, oh, I, I see curls forming. Okay, well, that just screwed up my hair. My hair was straight and now it somehow made my hair frizzy. Like, I don't know how that happened, but I'm willing to give it another go. Can I see this? How is it making the hair frizzy? Like, I don't understand. I'm so confused right now. <sighs> oh my God. After the 18th try, she finally got it. So this thing is working. I mean, I only got one piece to work, but. Okay. You know, I'm going to be honest, like, for me, a curling iron is just easier. Um, with a straightener, I only, like, typically will flip my hair like literally flip my hair out on the ends or curl it under I must be doing this wrong with stuff like this it's just like slightly gimmicky and so I typically don't mess with stuff like this uh, but it works I mean it, it honestly if you do have like skill with things like this I think you would probably like it the price is so affordable it heats up really quickly really hot it has different heating settings I am horrible at things like this um, with weird devices. I think I'm pretty decent at styling hair. Decent, I say. This is just not the bee's knees. So with that being said, like for me personally, I probably won't use it again. But if you want to try it out, it heats up. It may take a little practice, but it does kind of work. So that is it for today's video. I'm going to straighten this part of my hair again. Look at our curl though, we did that. Couple things were a complete flop, couple things worked out, and couple things were absolutely great. Um, thank you guys for being here and watching. Be sure and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. And if you wanna turn your notifications on so you'll be the first to know when I upload, well then by all means, turn them on. <laughs> I love you guys and I will see you all in my next video. Stay safe, stay healthy, and wash your hands. Love you guys.